everybody, welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here, my name is Lauren. In today's video, we have another holiday gift guide. I know I've been doing a lot of these lately, but it is officially December 1st, so the holiday season is fast approaching. This one is a little bit different. This is gonna be a luxury holiday kind of gift guide, but still on a budget. So I have three items, two from Hermes, one from Louis Vuitton, and I think it's under the $100 price point, $200 price point, and $500 price point, if I'm correct, yeah. So let's just get into this because I got goodies to show you. Let's start with Hermes first because a couple of videos ago, I did my very first Hermes unboxing and I was very underwhelmed <laughs> with the whole experience. Um, I will link it somewhere here. It was, I had ordered two items and they were basically just kind of like thrown in the box. Um, and I just, for my first unboxing, I kind of, wanted the whole experience, I wanted to get the beautiful orange box, blah, 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 but um, I didn't. This time around, I did. So it came in two separate packages, which um, I don't know, I guess they just sort of shipped at different times. So this one is the gift and I will show you what's inside and hopefully I can kind of retie this the correct way. So it did actually come with the card. Um, I did write a little personalized message in there for her so last time i had specified it was a gift and asked for a blank card and they didn't give it to me so this time they did um it just has i think it's called embossed or is it yeah so like just the embossed um hermes logo and there is um a custom sort of note in there for her so i don't want to read it i don't think she watches my videos but in the off chance that she does sometimes she does so I'm not gonna read it because obviously then she'll know, but um, this is the first item here. And like I said, this is a gift. So let me try and unwrap this. So I was able to kind of keep the bow intact, but um, I will try and retie that ribbon as best I can. And here is the box. When you open it up, I haven't looked at any of this. So this has just been sort of sitting in my place for the past couple of weeks, but um, I've been waiting to film this. So. Here we go, when you open the box, there's just some paper there. Oh, cute, ooh, it's so cute. Oh my gosh, they're in like their own little sort of individual, kind of like, I don't wanna say, there's not like bags, but um, not like dust bags almost. So this is a perfume set. Um, I don't know if there's an actual name for it. It just says, compose your own set of four travel sizes. So you, it says, let your imagination run wild and compose your gift set by selecting four 15 mil travel sprays of your choice, a gift for yourself or for someone else. Um, so these are so cute. Okay, so this packaging is really nice. I just thought they would kind of like put the perfume in the box. I didn't know you get these little individual kind of like perfume dust bags. So. Um, I chose them all. Oh, so I think each one will also say what perfume it is. Um, I just kind of went off the notes and I don't really know perfume notes at all, but I just looked at the notes and I kind of know what she likes. And so I just, I kind of took a guess at which one she would really enjoy. So this is cute. So this is the perfume. This is 15 mils. This looks way bigger than 15 mils. Because I'm a foods teacher, and so I know a 15 mil spoon, and this looks just way bigger than 15 mils. This is like a very generous sized perfume, as you can kind of see there. So it's beautiful, so the top, I don't really wanna to touch it, like I said, because it is a gift. It just has the Hermes logo there, and it says the name of the perfume there. And um, like I mentioned, it also gives you the name of the perfume here. So I guess the person, or if you're, it's for yourself, you know which one you're putting on. But this is beautiful, I love this. Um, my friend is a huge perfume lover, so hopefully I chose some scents that she will like, but it's nice because then you get to try all four of them. So this item was in total, and I'm in Canada, so please note that, but this item was $152 and then plus tax. But I feel like for getting four sample sizes and like, for, not sample sizes, travel sizes of perfumes, I feel like that's a good value 
right? Because perfume can be fairly expensive. So, I mean, essentially it's like, say we go like 160, it's like $40 for each perfume. Um, and you get to try them. So, and you get this lovely packaging. So this is nice too, because it will kind of protect it. Like if you put it in your purse or your travel bag or anything like that. So I love this. I hope she loves it too. I feel like she will. I feel like she'll really enjoy this. So I think this is a really great gift set. Um, I, so this is under the $200 mark. Since I got home from work, I've been waiting to film. And they've been going all day. It's driving me insane. But they also have another one where you can choose four different colognes as well. It's relatively the same price. But I just think this is such a great gift for a fragrance lover. Getting to try four different generous size fragrances. And then they can buy the full size of the one that they like the most. So this is my first item in the gift guide. I'm not going in order of price. I really should have thought this through. The next item from Hermes is under the $100 mark and it is this one right here. As you can see, it is not in a box, but it is beautifully wrapped, which I do appreciate. I knew it wouldn't come with a box because under the item description on the website, it said it wouldn't come with a box. So you can probably tell right now that it is a book. So I think this would be really nice for anybody that is really into home decor and they like to show sort of like on their coffee table some nice books i think this would make an amazing present so i'm just unwrapping it this one is for me so obviously i can just take the ribbon off easily and i did also say it was a gift so they provided me with um the blank card I just wonder why my last item because the last items that i bought were obviously more expensive than these items. I just wonder why it was just so poorly packaged, but I have my card here and this book I think is so beautiful and my niece and my nephew come over quite often. Actually, we're babysitting my friend's um, kids this weekend. So I think that this is so beautiful. This is the Hermes pop-up book. So I believe this one is $52 Canadian, but I had seen pictures of it online and it is just stunning like it is beautiful as you can see it's just so beautiful it's like a book of art almost so um i think it will be really nice for my niece and nephew to go through this book honestly is so stunning i think just not even for kids for anybody that just comes over i really feel like they would appreciate this i used to love pop-up books as a kid so I think that this is, oh cute, the hearts come out. I just think this is such a beautiful book. So um, if you, oh my gosh, this is so cool. This book would make such a beautiful gift for anyone that really likes home decor or likes displaying books. If I received this as a gift, I would honestly love it. So it is so beautiful. This is probably my favorite because I am a cat lady, so. This is just, it's so gorgeous. It's just a really beautiful book. And I feel like anyone that also appreciates art would also really like to receive this as a gift. The last item on my gift guide is from Louis Vuitton. And this would be the one that's under the $500 price point. I think here in Canada, taxes all in in BC, I paid $400 for it. If you remember my last Louis Vuitton unboxing, it was a complete fail. It was the envelope business card holder and it was just full of defects. So. And that item is so hard to find and it's always out of stock and it's never in stores. So <sighs> I was really upset. However, I'm trying to open this without ruining the ribbon. I was able to find another one. I don't know how it happened. I am stalking the website and usually I'll go on at very odd hours. Like on the weekend, I'll go on at like 1130 at night or in the mornings when I get from work, I'll go on at like 5.45 in the morning. And I was able to snag it. And this one, I already looked it over, is in perfect condition. Oh, This one is also made in France. And I know after my last unboxing where it was made in France and it was just terrible quality people are saying like made in France doesn't always matter but I generally do like a made in France item like if because Louis Vuitton is a French brand right so anyway this one is in perfect condition the glazing 
on the side is totally fine. My last one had like lots of jagged edges here on the piping. This one is perfect. Trust me, I went over to like Natural Daylight when I got this. I opened it up and I checked it over and everything is good. If you haven't seen this item before, I will leave the information for you down below, but that is also the information there. Um, it does come in on prompt leather. It's super hard to find. I just went on the website right now and it says notify me. And then it says this item has very limited availability online and in select stores. So I have never seen it in stores. I was really lucky to be able to um, get it again online. It shipped. This one took quite a bit longer to ship to me. Um, that's why I was actually kind of waiting to film this video. Um, it took about, I would say, two weeks after I got it online to actually ship out to me. So I wasn't sure if I would even get it, but it is perfect. And I think this would just make a great little mini wallet. You have the space in there to put money or cards. You have a space here to put cards. You can put cards in this little slip pocket there and then you have another slip pocket to put some cards. So like I mentioned, this all in costs $400 Canadian. So for a small mini wallet under the $500 mark from Louis Vuitton, that's almost impossible to find. So if you are able to get this, I think this would make such a wonderful gift. And like I said, I'm really lucky that I was able to find it online again um, and um, that this one is in perfect condition. So I'm gonna put it back in its cute little dust bag. Like I said, I did place this order online and it did come with a bag. You just need to specify at the end when you're checking out, please include a bag. Um, I think that's just really nice if you are going to be gifting it so you can actually put it in the bag and they get like the whole experience again. Um, so. Those are the luxury items I would recommend and I think would make really great gifts. Again, under the $100 price point, $200 price point, and let's just say $400 price point because really with taxes and everything, it was $400. So if you have any questions, please leave them down below. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.